Hello, uh, my name is Meet uh, Gundigara. I am from Gujarat, Bhavnagar. So I'm working, I'm a software developer working in Amazon. We all know like about the Corona pandemic, right? In the second phase, like a uh, lot of people were affected due to Corona in 2021. So I was also affected. So I didn't know like uh, what medicine like doctor gave, but I think uh, most of the doctor like uh, in Corona gave PredMed 16 or some kind of steroids format medicine. So yeah, after Corona, I was affected by Corona in April 2020. And so I get to know like after in September, like uh, September, October time frame, like I was feeling little discomfort like while running and also I used to play cricket every week. And so my running was affected like uh, uh, slightly. So then I went to two trips and I went to tracking as well. And so after that, like I faced a lot of discomfort, starting a uh, lot of discomfort. So First, like initially, I was feeling pain in knee. Like so, when I walked, when I when I start walk and like I'm sometimes it becomes friction in the knee. Like so, initially, like uh, I went to some local doctor. So some of them were say it's like that uh, it was just a muscle problems and it was nothing more. And some one of the doctor went for knee MRI and then like finally after one month, like I went to one another doctor and then he suggested for AP MRI and then my avian got diagnosed like and with the stage 3 and uh, so initially like uh, doctor told me that it was the initial symptoms like looking at that uh, and he suggested that uh, uh, medicine like everyone knows like osteophos like everyone a doctor like uh, preferred that medicine per week like uh, but <clears throat> yeah like uh, after 3 months like I went for another MRI like I wanted to do another MRI because uh, I I mean I started physiotherapy in February or, uh, itself, but like after six months, like with the physiotherapy also like uh, uh, nothing uh, much improvement in the result. Like so, so I wanted to like spread an awareness. Like AVN is not like only about the pain and uh, 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 limping and all. Like it's I mean majorly it affects your range of motions, uh, like movements. Like for example, you cannot. Uh, uh, I mean I, like slightly like I felt discomfort uh, sitting behind the Activa. Then I, in April, like I wasn't able to drive even the Activa, like so it was a very discomfort, like while driving the Activa. I can still drive the car, like, uh, but yeah, I mean it's about it. It will mostly affect your range of motion, so you can you can uh, diagnose also you, uh, on your own, like uh, itself, like uh, you can do the flexion activity, like so this this kind of your leg should be uh, uh, moved to the knee knee to, knee to chest movement should be done properly, like. You can check like that online, like uh, uh, search about abduction, uh, ro rotation, like flexion. That moment will get affected, like eventually, like and and that's how you diagnose the AVN. Like so, it's very difficult to diagnose the AVN in terms of medical. Uh, but yeah, you can diagnose early, like uh, and go for the treatment. Like I would prefer. So how I came, I'll talk now. How I came to Dr. K J Reddy sir. Uh, so. Yeah, in these three months, like I researched a lot and like uh, what can I go for alternate treatments uh, because I don't want to do hip replacement uh, because hip replacement uh, will have uh, their own problems. Like you can never run uh, on your hip like uh, when you do after do you after you do the hip replacement. Um, so I mean, you can never uh, regain your natural hip. I mean, the natural hip uh, you should try to preserve. So I search a lot of treatments like and then I came to know about the stem cells and bone grafting and there are some uh, these two options are like really good like so and then I research uh, I, I research about this uh, sir and like I found one very good video like uh, I mean that very I mean the uh, India's uh, best orthopedics were doing research on the AVN and uh, uh, the Dr. KJ Reddy sir was a moderator, so he has a very good knowledge about the AVN. Like so, and then I came to Hyderabad. Uh, even it, since my job is also there in Hyderabad, so I went to Hyderabad uh, and I first I took appointment online for uh, using Apollo application, and uh, then I came to Hyderabad and then uh, he suggested for the uh, go the bilateral sur uh, surgery in both hips, like. Uh, one was in stage 3, one right was in a stage 2. So K, uh, KJ Reddy sir suggested to go with the bone grafting in left and uh, with the stem cell in right after another 6 weeks. So yeah, I went for both the surgeries and 
I'm feeling very good like in terms of like stiffness. So most of the people will feel stiffness uh, in the nights. Like uh, I, I also used to feel the stiffness uh, during the nights. Like uh, I can't move from one side to another side, like uh, not easily like uh, and yeah, you'll no, not even get to sleep also. Like I mean, sometimes it happens that also. So yeah, that kind of comfort, like I am really feeling good. Like after doing both the surgery, it's my, I think uh, my surgery happened on the 2nd September 2022 stem cell and bone grafting 20 July uh, 2022. So now I'm feeling very comfortable in some of the movements and my movements also improved. Like, uh, so stiffness and all will reduce. Like, so first, I mean, uh, the movement is, I mean, the greatest improvement is stiffness. Like, uh, uh, initially, like, I can't even do my straight leg raise up, like, uh, and I felt a lot of discomfort. Like, now I can, like, easily do my le uh, leg up, uh, lift my leg up. Like, so th these kind of improvements are definitely there. Like, uh, even the rotation range improved. So, flexion is still under progress. So, it will improve. Like, it will take some time. Like, it's not there you do the surgery and just recover on the spot like it takes some time so uh, it will take some one one year after uh, taking the regular medicine uh, osteophores and all but yeah overall it's a very good improvement after surgery and i would really recommend dr kj reddy uh, sir to go ahead and like uh, do the surgery like in, because in the young age like it's not acceptable like when you are not uh, doing your routine like uh, and affecting your routine it's it's very, uh, I mean, difficult to. Sorry. So I mean, I will all, I would suggest that to go for stem cell and bone grafting, like wherever, it, whatever treatment it will fit to you. Like, you should go there uh, in the early stages and diagnose the AVN in early stages and go ahead with the treatment. And KJRDs are have excellent uh, experience and he have done a lot of surgeries. I think as far as I uh, believe. So I mean, excellent results uh, to me, like itself. So, yeah, thank you, thank you so much.